I haven't done a Q&A video in I don't even remember the last time, so I think it's been months. So I really wanted to do one of those today, so I took to Twitter as I always do. My phone is charging right now, but hopefully we got some good questions on here. So let's do this. April HXO asks, will you ever be coming to Canada? Love you, girl. I love you too, and I really, really hope so. My really good friend Drew lives in Canada in Newfoundland, so if any of you guys live there, let me know in the comments, but I would absolutely love to come. Me and Drew have talked about it, me coming and visiting him. Hopefully, hopefully I can do that at some point this year, but if not, like, for sure, late this year or early next year, I am going to visit Drew and I'm going to go to Newfoundland and hopefully I can go some other places too because Canada, it's just weird that I've never been to Canada because it's right next to the United States. Like, it's really not that far away and I would like to go. I heard people there are really, really nice, so I would really like to come there. Kylie Noom asks, where do you think you would be right now if you never started YouTube? That's really weird to think about because I've been doing this for over four years so I don't like know anything different but I think I would probably just be at an east coast four-year college something like that something like what most of my friends are doing I don't think I would have gone all the way to the west coast probably not I might be still here in Georgia I don't know probably majoring in something not not beauty industry yeah, and I would probably just be, you know, like, having a job, working, living my life. I don't know, just enjoying the college life, I think, but it would be really, really, really weird. XO Nicolette 17 xo says, how do you feel about being so close to 1 million subscribers? Nothing but just so pumped and excited about that. Absolutely just cannot wait to hit a million so yeah I think I'm at like 965 right now my subscribers have been going pretty slow lately because I haven't been really uploading a lot but hopefully they will you know increase a little bit because I really really want to hit it soon so tell your friends tell your mom seriously uh, to subscribe if they're not that's something that I never ever even like pictured myself on YouTube like when I had a hundred thousand that was the biggest deal ever Ty Ty lid I don't know how to pronounce your username, says, what are you currently watching on Netflix? And I'm currently watching 90210. It's one of my favorite, if not my top favorite show that I have ever watched. It's that show that keeps me wanting to go every single episode. There's so much drama and I just, I always love it. And I'm pretty close to being done with it. So let me know what I should watch that you think I would like if you've watched 90210, because I want something similar to that. Let me know what you think I should watch on Netflix after I finish 90210. If you guys haven't watched it, I really, really think you should. There's like five seasons and it's super addicting. Christy, or at Christy Vetter, if you guys don't know Christy, asks me, how's life? Life is great. I just turned 20 on Friday, if you guys weren't aware. I did a vlog, I'll link it down below, of like some of my birthday celebrations. So if you guys want to see that, I'll link it in the description box. But yeah, I'm 20 now, which is actually insane. So I, would, I feel like I have to start acting more mature but I don't really want to. <laughs> Other than that, life is going great. It is just, I'm on my break from school right now, so I am so happy to be making videos for you guys and just at home visiting my family and my dogs and my friends. And I went to a festival this past weekend and I have another festival this coming weekend and then I'm going to visit my friend Alex or Adubs in Boston in next week. So I'm just very excited about a lot of things and I'm excited to get back to LA and all that jazz and I'm just loving life right now. So Christy, to answer your question, life is really good but I miss you a lot so we're hanging out as soon as I get back. Five sauce underscore addiction says will you be attending playlist tri-state and I'm very excited oh that was very I was like about to hit the camera I'm very excited to be announcing that I will be at playlist New York slash New Jersey I think it's mostly in New Jersey so so excited it is the weekend before Thanksgiving weekend so it's at the end of November this year so if you guys live around New Jersey around that area you should come I'm telling you playlist if you're going to go to any YouTube event it's my favorite I love it so much that's why I'm going all the way to New Jersey for it because I have so much fun at all the playlists so I will definitely be there and let me know if you're going to be there too because I would absolutely love to meet you guys. I'm going to try and host a meetup and I'll let you guys know details on that when I know them. Okay, Heather Roper 100 says, would you rather have nipples as fingers or fingers as nipples? <laughs> let me think about this. 
Okay, I would rather have fingers as nipples because if you had 10 nipples, that would be like here. Uh, people would see them all the time and that would just be kind of odd, but I feel like not very many people see your nipples. So if they were fingers, like yeah, that would be pretty weird, but it wouldn't be as weird as having 10 nipple fingers. D33 coming says, are you planning to get a tattoo? And I don't have plans to get a tattoo, but I'm not opposed to tattoos. I'm not against them. I think for me, it's the type of thing that I would have to have this idea that I really, really wanted. It would have to mean something to me and be something that I wanted to see every single day when I look down or whatever. So I wouldn't just get one to get one, but I definitely think I would get one in the future if, you know, the time was right. Forever Ally 4 says boyfriend with like six question marks and I feel like I get this question almost every Q&A but I don't always answer it but sorry to disappoint girl the answer is no. With that being said I do like to keep my private life pretty private so if I did have a boyfriend I wouldn't lie to you guys and be like oh no I don't have a boyfriend but I would probably just keep it on the down low because I don't like making stuff like that public you never know what's gonna happen and I just don't like making certain things not just with like relationships like that but with my friends and certain things I just like to keep private because I think it's important to have aspects of your life that are private no matter who you are I'm just a pretty private person I've always been like that so yeah but honestly girl the answer is no all right and the last question I'm going to answer for this video is from Melissa underscore Smith and she says how does it feel to be 20 love you Lindsay I love you too and it feels honestly really weird like it was not a birthday that I was excited about it snuck up on me so fast I cannot believe that I'm not a teenager anymore I just feel like 20 is I don't feel like it's old but I feel like it's so different than being a teenager like I am in my 20s now and that is so weird to say like I, I have not accepted it I really have not accepted it it's honestly very odd but uh you know we're doing it one step closer to being 21 I suppose. You gotta grow up sometime. You can't avoid time. It just happens. It happens. So I wanted to say also thank you guys for wishing me a happy birthday on Instagram, on Twitter, on YouTube. Any of you who wish me a happy birthday. I had an absolutely awesome day. I went to a music festival here called Music Midtown and on my actual birthday um, Lord performed along with some other people but Lord was absolutely amazing. Like I I would go see her again like so 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 many times like that exact performance so good so yeah if you like her you should definitely try and go see her in concert or at a festival or something and yeah it was a very very great way to spend my birthday so that is that I hope you guys enjoyed this video give it a big thumbs up if you did and if you want more Q&A's and let me know in the comments what other videos you guys want to see from me because I have a lot of time in the next couple weeks to film videos, so I want to know what you want to see. And I will see you guys very soon in my next video. Bye!